Hey, we just came home from a beautiful baptism. There was a German family who got baptized now, and they're from a Mennonite background. They got baptized when they were 16, but it was very different that time. It was more as a tradition, not in repentance as it was today. And they did not get freedom and the Holy Spirit as they did today. In this video, there is first a three, four minutes where they are sharing their testimony, what happened today. And then you after this can see how I baptized both of them and how they received the spirit, how they both speak in tongues. And you can see how I worked a little with them afterward where we prayed in tongues, start and stop and start and stop just to get them to be used to it. Because speaking in tongues is, is very hard for some people, especially when they have it in the head. And Thomas, one of them who got baptized today, he, he had a lot of things in his head, he said, and he was very not sure that, that what he should do when it comes to speaking in tongues, and, and it was difficult. But, but it broke today. He got baptized, came out of water, he started to speak, and, and then suddenly it broke, and, and it just came out of him, and they were very, very excited, and, and we had a good talk afterward with them, and we meet with them again. And I just came home. But here is the video where they share the testimony. And then you see the baptism afterward. And then I end up with a little word to you out there. Freely receive, freely give. See this. <laughs> hey, I'm in Mexico still. And, and I met a family here from Germany. And uh, and they have lived here a few years. And, and we have talked over the coffee table. And they had two amazing twins here. Ah! Look here. <laughs> and and they just got baptized and, and, and spoke in tongues. How was it? I have a video of it, but how was it? It was unbelievable. Your lips start moving and and then words floating out. So yeah. Oh it's it's high. It's, it's warm for the kids. Oh, like <laughs> yeah, and, and for me it was really like destroying a barrier. I, I really noticed how how my mind is surrendering at one point I was struggling at first a lot uh, with doubts and uh, overthinking and then at some point I just noticed that this barrier was was broken into and uh, my mind basically surrendered and I, I felt that something else is taking over and uh, you, you come from a you have been in a religious background yes. mm -hmm. uh, can I say what background yeah sure okay yeah. some Mennonites and so on and and they actually got baptized when they were 16, because they have to be like that. When they were 16, they got baptized. But you know, many people today grow up in, in some settings where they do things because they was told. And why do you get baptized? Because you need it to. Yeah, it's uh, the next step after you repent. And it's just a symbolic thing for something that already happened yeah. inside. And even if you repent a long time before, it don't matter. It's 16. Do, yeah, yeah, then, exactly. then you get baptized. But today it was different. It, it was in the pool here. And, and it, 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 it was not a church event, but it was a faith thing. And we have been talking about baptism and repentance and what it was and the gift of the Spirit. And, and how much different is this baptism from what you did when you were 16? Yeah, when I was 16, it was just because it was a logical thing to do. Because when you're 16, you're supposed to get baptized if you want to be a member of the church. Yes. And it has actually nothing to do with faith at that point. Um, I was more thinking like what would the other persons think if I don't get it, if I don't get baptized now. Um, and now it really was because I, I wanted it and I want to, um, yeah, to experience the Holy Spirit. And we have the video clip of you and we can put, look at those train stays one here. <laughs> so hi, and then there's one here and it is two different girls <laughs> look the same so how was it for you it was a good day yes it was a good yeah. day. Yeah. Full day yeah. so what we say to all of you out there go and make disciples uh, like here connect go to the house sit over the coffee table share the gospel while you're drinking coffee and uh, and then go out and do it and it's so beautiful and it's new beginning now new beginning it was beautiful Come on, thank you, thank you. Thank you. it's for all of you out there <laughs> Get baptized, repent, get baptized, receive the gift of the Holy Spirit, and then follow Christ as a disciple in your everyday life. And we are called not only to repent, but to lead other people to repentance.
Not only to be baptized, but to baptize other people into Christ. Not only to receive the Holy Spirit, but to pray for others to receive the Holy Spirit. Freely you have received, freely you give. So love Jesus, go out my disciples. And I put some link in here together this video where I share the gospel and talk about the baptism of all and baptism with the Holy Spirit. God bless you. Bye bye. Okay, come on. This is beautiful. God is, is calling here. So, uh, Sabina? Are you ready to get baptized to Christ? Yes. Ready to follow him? Yes. Okay. So we baptize you to Jesus Christ and go down. Die with Christ, rise up with Christ. Oh, she's like, blah, 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 blah. freedom. Freedom, let go. Let go. Let go right now. Let go. We spit up fear. Go right now. Let go right now. Let go right Oh, How was that? Yeah, God, give me a hug. My lips just just shaking every yeah. moment, and my body also. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> yeah. I, I was feeling something. Hey, what? Something was coming over me. I was yeah. Because everything was like, yeah, I was feeling a little bit dizzy and a little bit also yeah. shaking my, my lips. Yeah. Just raging like this. Yeah. 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 Wow. But it's a new beginning. And, and now you, when you go out this water, you say to yourself, I am leaving the old thing behind. It's this new beginning. It's no more of the, the old Sabina living. It's a new Sabina. The old thing is spreading. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So on your own faith, I baptize you to Jesus Christ and go down. Die with Christ, rise up with Christ. Go, 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 every like, go, every like, go. I break every, I break that in the name of Jesus. We speak life, life, life to you, life. Oh, badada, cascasa, you speak. Shilo, do, 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 cascasa, la, da, 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 Oh, yes, she laughed. The whole thing is gone. The whole thing is gone. Oh, she laughed. Oh, she laughed. Oh, she laughed. Oh, she laughed. Oh, Oh, beautiful. Come on. That's good. That's good. That's God, we thank you for this family, God, and I pray your blessing upon this family, about this household, God. God, that your peace, your shalom shall be on them, God, over the girls, God, over the kids, God, over them, God. Thank you for a new beginning, God, and that we serve you, God, and you use them in the household. This is going to be a place of peace, a place where life is going to be changed. This is going to be a pool where many are going to be baptized, God. Thank you for the call you are given them. Thank you for a new beginning, God, in the name of Jesus. We just bless them and we give them over to you, God, in the name of Jesus. We thank you for what you are doing, God. In the name of Jesus, God. In the name of Jesus. 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 Name of Jesus. Name of Jesus. How was that? Wow. Wow. It was hard to start. And I noticed that my mind is always kicking in. And yeah. what are you making some weird noises? What yeah. do people think? Yeah. And then yeah, I just tried to overcome. Yeah. And then suddenly you just felt like, yeah. come on. <laughs> hey, look at me. Don't think too much. Look in my mouth. When I pray, you pray. When I stop, you stop. Now. Stop. So now you have it. So now you use it and get used to it. Sometimes when you pray, you suddenly feel like it's and it's taking you in another direction and new words are coming and you can prove it using your prayer life when you pray, God, I thank you, I thank you. And you pray in your language. And sometimes when you don't know what to pray in your language, you then pray in tongues, and then some, and then you pray your own language again, and then tongues, and then you use it like this. Oh, it's either. Oh, thank you. That was good. I love it! <laughs>